Hey guys, so I'm here with Tony V. Hi. And uh, Tony, okay, for those people out there that aren't familiar with Black Box TV on YouTube, can you tell us about it? I came up with the idea about a year ago. I was working on Zombies uh, for the station, and a little bit before that I was, I was thinking there's no genre channel on YouTube, and it's something that I love and that I want to see on YouTube. I've created a series in the past, and also a directed series in the past, uh, Harper's Globe, 2009 True Story, that were very like sci-fi, horror kind of, and I had really, I really missed doing that stuff. So I was talking to Phil, and I was like, dude, I really want to watch Philip this. DeFranco, if you guys don't know. <laughs> I told him, you know, I really want to launch this channel. I think this could be really cool. And he was like, you should do it, you know. Um, we're, we're not only producing uh, partners, but also partners in some of the other stuff that we do. And it seemed like a really good mix. And it was also something, obviously, to bring to the YouTube community that we felt was missing. We didn't feel it was cool that people had to sort of go off YouTube to see uh, to see genre and horror and all that kind of stuff. So we just brought it home to our YouTube community. So how often do the videos come out? Um, the videos come out, uh, how, what our schedule works like is we have three weeks of episodes and then on the fourth week we'll have an interview with the director like what we just did with Wes Craven or we'll do a little bit of like sort of production updates and then we go down for two weeks and then we go back up for four weeks. I've worked on a lot of different shows on YouTube and, um, and for Phil as well, it's like it's always quality first. And with the show that Phil does, like him doing that show four days a week, it's a lot of work. He busts his ass to make that show great and fresh every time. And I was, I was feeling like for this, I really wanted to put out just one episode a week and, and focus sort of all my resources and all my energy into that one thing and making sure that that was really good. I know a lot of, a lot of the, the sort of bigger channels now, they're just dumping so much content. And for me, I still believe it, it's, it's, uh, it's quality over quantity, in, in, in my opinion. And I feel like for YouTube, I, I feel like with uh, Freddie Wong, with Mr. Guitar Man, um, with the stuff that we're, we're about to launch another channel that I actually can't talk about right now, but um, mm. with all the stuff that everybody's doing, I feel like we're all moving the medium forward. And I think that it's important to do that. When you have somebody like Donation TV, when I first saw Bob Thunder and saw what he was doing, I was like, okay, YouTube is changing and YouTube has, has really sort of um, evolved into it's, it's evolving into the standard for online video. And I never, I never thought that would happen. And I'm glad it's happened uh, around me and that I get to work with the people who are, who are responsible for doing that. I wanna know though, like where do these ideas come from? Uh, not only from you, but can people submit? Because I know you guys yeah. have blackboxtelevision.com as well, so. Yeah. yeah. Um, people are submitting right now. There's over 600 submissions right now. I didn't. I oh like. I, it kind of blew me away, and I was just like, "Oh my god!" Because uh, that's a lot of people, and it's a lot of reading. Um, and so we've been going through the ideas. There's some that have definitely popped out, but we already, before we even started the channel, we had like about 12 ideas in the can because we actually didn't think people would submit. Mm -hmm. We thought we'd see sort of a trickle down. So the fact that so many people submitted really, really shocked me. It's fucking awesome. It's our community. I you love know? Black Box TV. It's just like it's your baby right now. You love it. It's I, his love. I love it. I love it. And and I'm and you know honestly like uh, I did this show called Green Eye World last year. It was a very bright show. And I've done I did Harper's Globe in 2009, a true story, and they were sort of more dark shows. And I've learned that this is the stuff that I love. I love to you know horror is all about lack of information and about and about environments and it's everything that I love about being a director. And just like honestly, I two years ago was not watching horror movies. I was totally afraid of them. And even to this day, like when I'm watching horror movies, me and Phil, a couple of people went and saw um, The Last Exorcism. Oh, and so I was goodness. like buried down in the seat with yeah. my hoodie over my eyes, just to, just to edit it. But I love the fact that something like that has that much energy and that there's so much energy in the audience. And then it's sort of like, I love scaring the shit out of myself. And I don't know if we're succeeding or not doing that with our viewers, but that's my only goal is to give them a charge and to give them something new and fresh and exciting. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, well that's that, and this is Tony. Ah, oh, <laughs> thank you Tony. All this right. is awesome, she's in Black Box TV, two episodes down, this girl's amazing! Oh my gosh! Thank you, no, thank I you love very much. getting my ego stroke. Okay, bye. Cheese! <laughs>